Hey dinosaurs, today I'm going to show you guys my collection of sharks, dolphins and whales, okay? So let's get right into it. The very first figure right here is actually a brand new humpback whale from Papel. Check this out, it has a movable mouth. Wow, looks very very amazing. And you can even see the detailing inside the jaw, inside the mouth, which looks very impressive. Wow, what a beautiful wheel figure. I think this has got to be one of our biggest, if not the biggest wheel figures, okay? Next up, let's have another look. This is also a brand new figure that we have just added. It is a gray wheel. Yep, that's right. Okay, here is another new figure. So let's open this up together. I think this is a guitar fish, which is also known as a shark ray. But do you guys know that, you know, ray sharks or shark rays, I mean shark rays, they're actually not sharks or rays. Yes, that's right. Beautiful little figure right here. I think this is our second guitar fish. All right. I mean, if I got the facts right, please let me know down below, okay? Next up, a white whale figure from PNSO. This is also a brand new figure that we have added to our collection very recently. And we also purchased plenty of new, you know, shiny sea animals right here. We have an orb car. It actually comes with a beautiful blue spot right here, okay? It has a movable tail as well and the flippers can move. Very beautiful. Right here, we have a bow head wheel. All right, I think it's time for us to take a look at some sharks. This is a Megalodon. Yes, which is a prehistoric shark, okay? A figure from Safari LTD. And speaking of more sharks, check this out. We have a beautiful hammer head shark right here with movable arm um, head and also tail and flippers. Blaineville's Big Whale, a very, very interesting looking whale right here. Okay. Now, Will, this little spear is actually a tooth, a tusk. And um, I think experts actually, you know, they feel that this spear, this tooth, this tusk right here, can be used to like detect like temperatures and other different elements. So yep, I don't have the full details, but if you guys know, let me know down below as well. Okay, let's move on. Another car figure. What is this? This is actually a sperm whale. You can actually easily recognize this with the very squarish head. Right here we have a pilot whale. Okay, pilot whale is actually one of the most docile um, species of dolphins around. This is not a white whale, this is a beluga whale. Nice. What else we've got? We have plenty of sharks. And um, this is a new figure that we have just purchased. A basking shark. Yes, with the jaw, the mouth wide open. We have two of them. What is this? The Great White Shark. The Great White Shark is definitely one of my most favorite sea animals. What about you guys? I want you guys to let me know down below. And um, this is a, I think this is a blue whale, if I'm not wrong. I'm not too sure. This one right here is another gigantic humpback whale figure as you guys can see. But I think this one is bigger. So let's do a comparison. This is from Safari LTD, a humpback whale. And let's take a look at this fact card right here. It says, humpback whales are famous for the haunting songs they sing. Wow, cool. Can you guys tell me what species of shark is this? Is this a zebra shark or is this a leopard shark? Let's take a look. Oh, it is actually a leopard shark, nice. This one right here is a short fin mako shark. I think these fins right here are really short, which is why it's known as a short fin mako shark. I'm not 100% sure, but I think so. That's my guess. Another Nawil figure that we have just purchased. This is from Schleich. It looks so cute and adorable. Whale shark. Whale shark is actually a pretty docile 
um, sea animal as well. Okay, it is a filter feeder as well. What is this? We have the original whale shark figure. This is this was actually our first whale shark figure. Another Okar. Sperm whale. Okay, you can see our collection of whales, dolphins, and sharks. It's actually pretty big. This is the other shark ray figure that I've told you guys, okay? So let's take a look at a fact card. It lives in the Indo-Pacific Ocean waters. Let's quickly do a comparison with the previous figure right here. Yeah, they definitely look um, very, very similar. Oh, not this one. I got the wrong one. I beg your pardon. This is actually the other um, shark ray. Yeah, that's right. All right. Let's take a look at this. Okay, this figure is actually a whale, a blue whale from Colorado. We just purchased this figure not too long ago. What is this? This is a grey reef shark. Oh, a thresher shark. I beg your pardon. I didn't see the tail. I thought it is a grey reef shark, but yes, this is a thresher shark. You can easily recognize this, you know, with its significant, with its trademark long tail. Vaquita, yes, this is actually critically endangered. It is, um, there are less than like 10 left in the world, which is very, very sad. We have a mega mouth shark, which is a very, very obscure looking um, shark. It is actually very rare and can only be found like deep underwater. This is a say will, I think, that's right. This is a Bonner head shock, if I'm not wrong. Oh, it's a hammer head shock. It looks like a bonnet head shock. This is a blue shock. Let's try it. And this is the right wheel. Let's try it. It has like plenty of like white spots and bumps. Very interesting. This is known as a what is does it is it like the jobber gang or something like that? Wobber gang? Wobber gang? Yes. This is the name of this fish. Wobber gang. Another basking shark right here. This is a beautiful tiger shark, if I'm not wrong. Let's try right, tiger shark. A smaller humpback back whale. Looks really beautiful. What about this? Are you guys able to tell me what species of whale is this? This is known as a mink whale. Nice. And um, this is known as a lemon shark. A great white shark. This is a hammerhead shark baby. Yeah, I'm not kidding you. It is actually written as hammerhead shark baby. It's supposed to look like adorable, but it looks like a normal adult shark to me. What about you guys? What do you guys think? Um, I think this is a beluga whale calf. Right here. This is a. Um, I can't really tell. It looks like a zebra shark. Let's see. Yeah, that's right. Zebra shark. This is a beluga whale, a small little one. Another one. Yes, this is actually from the Colorado set, a set from Japan. This is a bamboo shark. What else we've got? This is a scallop hammerhead shark. Yes, the strut, you can see the shape of the hammerhead is actually slightly different. There are a lot of like bumps over here. Okay, there's like curves and stuff. This is a, a bottlenose dolphin. Yeah, that's right. This is a bull shark, which is a um, pretty aggressive species of sharks. And this is a grey reef shark, if I'm not wrong. Let's take a look. That's right. So as you guys can see, there are plenty of different species of sharks just alone. This is another great white. This is the bonnet head shark. So you guys can see this hammer head right here is actually much smaller than, um, than uh, this one right here you can see. And um, this is the scallop hammerhead shark, and this is the uh, normal hammerhead shark. So you can see the bonnet head shark is actually very different 
it's so much shorter but it still has a kind of like similar shape to the hammerhead a bonnet head shot which is a um, close relative to the hammerhead shot this one right here it looks like a leopard shot I'm not, not too sure it looks like a uh, uh, I'm not too sure. It could be a tiger shark. This is an orca for sure. They're extremely intelligent. River Ganges Dolphin. Let's try Ganges River Dolphin. I beg your pardon. Oh yes, I think we need to purchase a goblin shark. We don't have a gob goblin shark. This is an Ichthyosaurus, which is a prehistoric um, sea creature. I'm not too sure. I mean, this is definitely not a shark. But yeah, I'm not, not too sure why is it doing here. This it's a zebra shark, if I'm not wrong. That's right. Another great white shark. This is a pygmy sperm whale, which is a re relatively small species of whales because the size of it is roughly the size of a dolphin. This is a nurse shark. You can actually re um, recognize it by this two little um, body parts that is protruding. They look like teeth, but I'm not too sure whether they are teeth. So if you guys know, please let me know down below. Or are they like fillers? This is a white tip reef shark. You can see all the fins have like, you know, a white tip at the top. So it looks pretty cool. White tip reef shark. Another dolphin. This is a... Um, should be a bottlenose dolphin, a small dolphin as well. Yeah, also a bottlenose dolphin. This is a blue whale. This is an um, Atlantic white sided dolphin. You can easily recognize this um, by its um, different colors on its body. Sawfish! I think sawfish is a type of shark, but I'm not too sure, so you guys let me know. Great white shark right here from Safari LT. Yet another great white shark. This one is cool. It has a movable jaw. The head can bend, the tail can bend. Um, not too sure what kind of a um, dolphin this is. Let's take a look. This is a Pacific white sided dolphin. Nice. And this should be a black tip reef shark, if I'm not wrong. Nice. Another great white shark figure. And our last figure of the day, it's not a shark. It is a manatee. I'm not too sure whether why is it doing it's a dugong. Why is it doing here? <laughs> this is weird. But then it's fine. Thanks for watching this. So this is basically my collection of um sharks, dolphins, and whales. It will definitely expand. So subscribe and um stay tuned for more videos.